I'm standing here with Max from Konichi. Hi okay. Max. And Max is uh, one of the founders and the CEO, right? And we are here on the border between Kreuzberg and Neukölln, which starts back there. And you are in here in this cool old building, the Umspannwerk. Yeah, exactly. And let's have a look inside. Let's go. And on the way, you can tell us uh, what is Konichi actually all about. Yeah, definitely. Um, so we ask ourselves, why are airline check-ins easier than hotel check-ins? Mm -hmm. Why is the hotel industry so old school? Mm -hmm. um, why are companies like Airbnb so successful? Mm -hmm. It's because the hotel industry have overslept trends. Mm -hmm. And um, we're there to change this. Um, so what we've done is we've developed a solution. Mm -hmm. um, it's basically based on a guest iPhone and a merchant iPad. Mm -hmm. um, when guests walk into a hotel, we mm -hmm. can recognize them in real time, okay. utilizing beacon technology. Ah, cool. um, basically what we do is we do three things. We call the three C's. Mm -hmm. uh, firstly, we do check in, check out. Mm -hmm. So basically we enable hotel guests to be recognized, mm -hmm. skip the check-in process, and pay through a smartphone similar to paying for an Uber or my taxi. Okay. Um, the second part is customization. Mm -hmm. So if you walk in, I know who you are. Mm -hmm. uh, you through our beacons, mm -hmm. I can give you a personal greeting. Good. And I know what your preferences are, and I can try and personalize your stay. Mm -hmm. And thirdly, it's communication. So basically, we create a platform so you and your guests can, or you as a guest and the hotel can can uh, interact and basically exchange information. You can order an additional towel. You can order mm -hmm. a bathrobe. Uh, and basically, eliminate the old school phone on your room. Sure. All about the convenience for the exactly. customer. It's about convenience, yeah. it's about personalization, Great. Um, and it's about basically making the hotel still mm. smarter. And have you guys uh, been working in the hospitality industry before, or how did you get about yeah. this? I was idea? working at Google previously, okay. um, in the travel space, um, mm -hmm. so I was not especially hospitality, it was mm -hmm. travel in general. Um, my mom actually, she runs a hotel, um, okay. so I had some kind of connection back yeah. then uh, <laughs> as a child. Um, and the majority of our employees have worked in hotels previously. Okay. Um, so we really want to ensure that we know the market, we mm -hmm. have domain expertise and can therefore then develop a product which is which is useful. Excellent. Okay, you guys are on the fifth floor? Yeah, let's go upstairs. Let's go up. Um, very cliche, let's do an elevator pitch here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, why are we in Berlin? Um, it's a typical question and loads of people ask us, guys, why did you choose Berlin? Mm. I personally never wanted to go to Berlin. Mm -hmm. um, I was born in Frankfurt, yeah. I'm a big fan of Frankfurt as well. Um, but the majority of our employees um, come from all abroad and mm. Berlin is for them a place to be and mm. they would have never come to Frankfurt. Yeah. Um, so Berlin is uh, one of the places for us um, to basically find and uh, find the best employees and basically mm. have the best setup for our company. And have fun. And have fun. <laughs> okay, now we're on the fifth floor, Max, and um, I see you have uh, big plans here, Unicorn. Yeah, I'm not sure. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's at least that's our ambition. Um, so we you know have to symbolize Unicorn here. So but trying to trying to get motivation up and motivate people say, hey, we can become a unicorn. <laughs> yeah, that's the long term milestone. So what are the next milestones? And maybe um, let's walk in already a bit. Um. Basically, there are a variety of milestones. Mm. Um, firstly, it's um, it's important for us to basically get the product out in the hotels. Mm. Um, so what we started is we started um, going to the first better hotels. Mm. We call them early grade hotels, uh, testing our solution. Um, next step is basically getting the official roll out. Mm. Um, so 9th of September, uh, so we're going to start. Um, mm. And from then on, we're going to roll out across Germany, Austria, and Switzerland. Mm -hmm. um, and um, that's sort of the first major milestone. Yeah. Um, to sort of the, the prior milestone of getting the product up and running. Mm. Um, so now basically we're ready to take payments. Mm -hmm. um, so we're completely um, PCI compliant. We can take payments similar mm. to Uber or MyTaxi. Mm. That was one of the big milestones for us. Um, having a solution which is running uh, is also really important. Mm. Um, so it was sort of the, 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 the previous milestones are now really it's getting it out there and collecting customer feedback and continuously improving the product. Uh, Fredo is gonna, gonna yeah. take over from here. Thanks so much and all the best. Huh? Thank you. Fredo, nice to meet you. Hey, great to meet you as well. Um, how are you? I'm fine. Cool. Thanks for taking a, a nice tour yet. Yeah, it's a nice way up here. Maybe let's walk a bit more in and um, how many guys are, are you at the moment? We're currently around 17 people, 17? Um, which is a nice split between engineering, mm -hmm. which are right here. Mm -hmm. um, and then we got sales and marketing over here on the side. Mistakes in general, personally, I wish I would have started earlier, mm -hmm. um, even though this is my, my second um, I used to work in, in or I used to work for corporates for mm -hmm. quite some time. I wish I would have started. A, I wish I would have started a company sooner. Mm -hmm. um, with Konichi right now, we haven't really, um, in my personal opinion, mm -hmm. we haven't really done any major mistakes. Um, That's good. We're extremely excited to see how 
market is going to react to it. I mean, mm. we have an awful lot of beta customers right now, mm. but it's something completely else. Um, if you're actually going live with the product, sure. and um, I, I guess that's when we are, are going to experiencing the <laughs> first problems with the product. Yeah. Uh, other than that, I'm extremely proud of the team. I'm extremely mm. proud of where we are right now. Mm. Um, we have officially started at the beginning of the year, mm. um, and after six to seven months, we are already ready to launch the product, which yeah, in awesome. my opinion is a great accomplishment uh, from everybody here. Yeah. Great. Well, Fredo, thanks so much for your time and Thank all you. the best for Kuniti. Thank you very much. Bye, guys.